Hello again, my name is Bradley Jones, and I'm just doing the commentary or just some comments on how the movie was, Show Me the Father. We just went Sunday uh, evening. Uh, to me, the music, uh, movie, not music, but the movie had a great impact on me. It, it had me remember my father. I had a lot of tears during the movie because my father was in Jesus Christ, but he, to me, he died at an early age. I believe he is in his 70s, but still yet, um, I believe he left too soon. But the great news is that he was with Jesus Christ. It reminded me of my father and missing my father. That's why I was so many tears. But then I love the I like I love the fact that it was rejoining uh, rejoining sons with fathers. I love the fact that uh, it even spoke about our heavenly Father dealing with the ones who didn't have a father. And then I also enjoyed the ones that had uh, biblically uh, sanctified priests of the household fathers. And it was really nice. It just it was really a blessing to me. I think I teared all the way through. I love the reunions of, of the, the one brother that was being mentored by the coach, I believe, or he had a mentor, and he found out that that was his father. After all the time, like 27 years, I believe it was, that he had been mentoring him and been close friends, and he found out that was his real father. That was so emotional to me. But also, too, afterwards, when we left, we all fellowshiped and went to the pizza place, and uh, I forget the name of it, but uh, we had a great time, and Sister Stephanie did an awesome job. I think she said they did 23 pizzas, and uh, we just had uh, much to drink. Everything was wonderful. The fellowship was great, and we just had an awesome time. But uh, I just thank that God for the scripture said how good and pleasant it is for the brethren to dwell in unity. And that was truly an awesome, truly an awesome time that all of us dwelt in unity in Jesus' name. God bless. Thank you.